big welcome to everybody watching this video. Welcome 2020. It is 2020, the start of a new decade. It's hard to believe that we are actually in a new decade. Sure is. Um, our heart goes out to all the people affected by the fires. So all throughout Australia, um, it's devastating watching it on the news and social media. Our hearts really, truly um, go out to those people and um, to all the volunteers that have volunteered mm. their time, including nurses, doctors, uh, paramedics and the Defence Force. Um, I think everyone's trying to help where they can. Yep, and it's not just all of those people, it's the average person fighting the fires. They've done some amazing things. We just want to uh, extend our support to all of those people that Definitely. have been affected. In saying that, we thought long and hard what to do at the start of a new decade. It's a new uh, set of opportunities. And we figured that it might be a good idea if we actually did a challenge, a 2020 challenge. Mm. Now the 2020 challenge will actually run for 12 months. And the challenge will be based around one week a month, and that will be the third week of every month. Just had this idea and we thought it might be worth a try just to get everyone back on track after the crazy Christmas period um, of doing something like having fruit in the morning, just fruit, there's an abundance of fresh fruit at the moment, loving the summer stone fruit. Uh, so I have the mangoes, the, fruit, the mangoes, oh, they're just divine. They're to die for. Fruit to lunchtime, then have a big salad for lunch, which also there's no shortage of fresh produce there. Buy what's in season, make most of the cheaper prices and the the um, wealth of vitamins and nutrition that's in those um, seasonal fruit and vegetables. And then finish off the day with just a light juice or if you're in a colder climate, a nice soup, just easy to digest and have a really good rest overnight without having to digest a heavy meal at night. You may choose to do a water fast on the first day just to shrink that tummy back a bit. Uh, also, there are some people that may choose to do a couple of days of just pure juice in the middle of the week. So that's the idea. So it's one week a month and we want to do it as a group. And I guess the question is, why do we want to do this? Well, there's a couple of reasons. For all of you who have been through the program, uh, you do know that it's good to go back to the basics. And this will be a way of taking us once a month for a whole week of going back to the basics. We strip out everything, you know, all the stuff that we still buy and use, even though it might be based around whole foods, but it's been put together in some fashion. This goes back to the very basics. I often say that, you know, we should be eating absolutely everything that we used to eat before they made the first food factory. And so, if we think about it that way, eating everything before they built the first food factory, then we really go back to what Joe was talking about, eating fruit, salads, juice uh, in the evening or a soup. But that will actually take us back to natural only foods as grown, unmodified. And so we want to see how we go as a group. And it will be very interesting to do this as a group and have that journey together as a group. We're really looking forward to your feedback and your input. And we're hoping that you're going to love the idea as much as we're excited about it and join us in the journey. So we'll be doing little monthly videos. Uh, they won't be long videos, but just little updates as we're coming up to that week, just to remind you and to let you know um, where we're up to and also to inspire everyone. Absolutely. I would like to encourage you to join. Now, obviously, if you've done the program, you'll want to be a part of this. We will be doing this as a group and we'll have a communication thing happening, which Joe will talk about in a minute, as far as a group goes. So you'll actually feel like you're a part of something that's happening together as a group, which will be fantastic. And remember, we've had a lot of people through the program, so the more the better. Uh, and we'll have a great time doing it together. So I want to really encourage you to join if you've done the program. But more than that, what we want to do is we want to make this available to everybody, including 
your family, the friends around you, the people that may have seen you do the program, encourage them to do it. And we will be then extending that reach. And now we are going to post the little videos and the messages on Instagram, which will be linked to our Facebook account too. So please like it, follow it, and spread the news to everybody you know. And on that note, there are two Facebook groups, as you know. The people that have done the program, you've got access to the private only group. So we're not going to put this in the private only group because it means that your friends won't be able to follow what we're doing. What we'll be doing is we'll be putting this on the public Facebook group. So uh, please follow it there. For your friends, just make sure that they do join the Facebook page uh, so that they can see and follow exactly what's going on. I will also be sending out a newsletter just before the week happens, a few days before that week starts. So it will be the third week of every month. We are starting on Monday and finishing on Sunday. So it'll be that full seven days, the third week of every month. We've picked that specifically to avoid things like Easter. Uh, so just before that week starts, I'll be sending out a newsletter. There'll be an updated video that you'll be able to watch. And then obviously being the Facebook group, uh, please start to contribute in the Facebook group as we do that, but we'll talk more about that. We may include a recipe or two in our newsletter or in our videos, just a short one, just to kind of give people ideas if you start running short of on, on ideas. And we also would love to hear back ideas from you guys and whoever else is on the journey. Absolutely. So, folks, we're looking forward to seeing you on the challenge. Sure, all the best. Mm -hmm.